Good morning. Today is day three. We woke up in Nuremberg today and we're heading to Munich in a bit. Since our train is not until two hours, which is really nice, we are just exploring the town in the morning. so much better in the morning. <laughs> At night, it's very romantic. <laughs> That's Kelvin down there. He's very excited about this trip. It started drizzling again. I feel like I live in Melbourne for so long. That little drizzle, some bad weather. <laughs> I'm just not faced by it. you to this little island that you can see on Google Maps. This bridge reminds me of the bridge in Hogwarts Castle. <laughs> I just love that the houses sit on top of this river. You can't really tell when you're on the other side. Oh, how cool is that? And that little house over there looks like it's sinking. I'd love to go inside. This is the little island that I told you about. This is what it looks like. It looks really nice during the day, but definitely so much more magical at night. So you see those little lamps? They light up and uh, it's full of Christmas vibes. I, I just can't believe how we're literally on a tiny little island in the middle of the river. It's got like this entire community living here. Give me more onion. More onion, yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome, thank you so much. One, right? one yeah, oh, just one. Just one. Thank you. Thank you. So Sanula is done. That's interesting. That's what we need. <laughs> we are heading to the train station. Yeah. Heading to meeting. On the way to Munich. That club of mine, that's us. When we see an escalator. It's life saving. Woo, look at that. I was gonna say, it's so much easier taking the train. I feel like you rock up to the train station so much earlier. You just don't need to. You just wake up, walk to the train station, the train's there, hop on, go check in. My gosh! Hey! This is definitely a city vibe. Very different from what we had at Nuremberg. A lot more people. Bigger in general, city vibe. This is so tiny. This is a tiny <laughs> And it only fits us. Hello. Hello. Wow, this Welcome. Does. Okay, we just got to a hotel in Munich. A very cute place. It's called Hotel Ruby Rossi, and I think you should see the place. When I booked this hotel, there was a lot of mixed reviews in terms of the sizes. I went for the vibe, and as you can see, it does look really nice. Other places are slightly further. I basically chose the closest one. The room is very small, but the surrounding area looks really nice. A quick overview of the room. This is pretty much it. Kelvin's literally standing at the door, it's like jam. if you can see. This is the toilet. Up here, this is the shower and you can pull the curtains. Oh my gosh, there is a speaker down there on the floor. I am very impressed. I don't think they're functional. It's checking. 
just checking there's nothing behind oh uh, when i book hotels i'm very scared of booking hotels there's like paintings on the wall there's a hotel that i saw in rome painting staring at you oh, right everywhere yeah. Oh, oh my gosh! We have a good view. That's like the subway entrance and we came from somewhere there. Well, this is the first time I get a full-length mirror. Let's do a quick OOTD. Everything's from Zara that I have today. Yeah, so I have this knit top, a cropped one. This is a little skirt pants. For the back, it's definitely pants. Tights from Bonds. And also this scarf is from Zara. I have my cute little earrings. This is from Wonderlust. I had this for a year. Do you know what? It's Christmas and I think it's quite cute and fitting for Christmas. That's pretty much it. Found a place. Piece of something. Just like a flat piece. Mm. Alex sauce is really good. Anyway, we just got food from that place. Okay, just got our tickets from this machine. If you want to take any bus, any trams, any trains, I guess you can just buy it here. It's not that hard. So now we're gonna go to the palace. So that will be fun. I love looking at maps. Eating my first pretzel. Really good. I didn't know pretzel was from here. I'm doing a went to the Lego store yesterday. I have pretzels made out of the Legos. That is very cute. Yesterday was the best night of sleep that we had. Definitely took us four days to really get used to the jet lag. Traveling was hard. Nuremberg was hard. Munich in general. It's nice. Now, hotel room is really great and we really highly recommend it. Dad, I'm so happy. 
I just lucked out with a bottle of still non-sparkling mineral water. So we found out from a guy says that the whole Germany loves drinking sparkling water. I feel you guys. I love it too. We can live here together. Finally found a whole nation that actually enjoys what I enjoy. <laughs> okay. Taking the 17 tram. Maybe validates it. Oh. Oh, it's a ticket puncher. <laughs> Alright, cool. Done. That will be my journal. Yes. <laughs> Done. Just make sure it's right. Yeah. <laughs> True. Very cute. Yeah. This little pouch is amazing. It's we got good. it for free from North Face. Yeah. It's great for when you're wearing something that's like super it thin. Is. Can't put money inside. Google Maps, it just shows you all of this. This is the bridge and mm -hmm. this is the waterway. Yeah, Look at it makes how sense. big this is. And they have a lot of palaces around. So the ones that are closed right now in yeah. December are these palaces. So this is still open, just not the little ones and now we're going in here. I just want to say that this reminds me of my Animal Crossing terraforming map. <laughs> <laughs> Take it. Nice. Hey, you only need one what, both places? Yeah. Oh, okay. Interesting. Hey, let's go. All right, cool. Yeah. This is the back of the Nymphenburg castle. We were spending a lot of time inside and now we're just exploring gardens at the back. Dios, wish I've never seen one in real life. <gasps> it's like Bambi. Hello. Oh, deer crossing. This is huge and we're trying to get to parts of it. When I saw the map, it looks exactly like a Universal Studio map. You yeah. walk here for hours and hours. I was joking to Kelvin, you know how people are like, I just need some herbs to cook. Just go to the garden and pick it. 
probably take like half an hour and an hour to come back. <laughs> but on the plus side, you could probably make any dish you can think of. There's so much space to grow stuff here. <laughs> Somehow, I really do appreciate the winter. Something about it that makes it look more poetic, more romantic. I like it a lot. So we're just walking next to the man-made stream, which you can tell from here. <sighs> this is what we see. Man, this scene looks like it's out of a fairy tale. Fairy tale. Imagine that there is a white horse just walking down here. It comes to this little stream, like drinking water. Ooh, that's fairy tale. And then birds come out and sing. Hi. Squeaking in a harmonized vibe. From day my friends will come. Like it's from Cinderella. And then you can see the carriage will pass. Yes! Finally made it. Look at that! One of the palaces. Oh, you look so good on the bridge. Take a photo of you. Really? So, like the last mini palace that we're at is this one. It's pink. Very pretty. Travel around what Uber exists. What? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, wow. Okay. Yep, that's something. This is going in the vlog, is it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> you saw that. I did, but there were extra bits of embellishment you've added. Like, kind of like the carriages. Yeah? There's no amount of videos and photos and prints that describes this in front of your eyes. <laughs> it is quite pretty. I feel like I'm done. I want to go. I want to go. Okay. We're heading out for one last Christmas market. But a little bit more waterproof. It's currently raining. Today's the 23rd. So all Christmas market closes on the 24th. We'll come back and have a walkthrough of the hotel bar. Munich has been very rainy since the first two days that we arrived. Today was a full day of raining. We went out to the palace this morning. Even until now, it's just pouring outside. That's why I changed another coat. This is completely waterproof. If you're looking for one, this is a trusty North Face jacket. I got it from Korea. Amazingly on sale because when we went there, it was summer. Boiling hot. It was like, <laughs> like almost 40 degrees. 40 degrees yeah. Obviously, we got it for cheap. Like, this is a floor length coat. Oh, yeah. Keeps you warm and toasty. So, the train station's all the way behind. And then, if you just walk down this way, all the way, it leads you to Mariam Floods. Marie's Square, I think. I will put the name Plaza. here. <laughs> Trying to get there. Easier to just go down to the underpass. Wow, well, literally, this is where everyone's at. <laughs> we've been to a few Christmas markets already. Actually, like this one, this is the second time that we've gotten. All they want to do today is to get a blue wine in a shoe cup. A shoe cup. <laughs> Doing an Aussie shoe in Munich. <laughs> it's the only hygienic way that you can do it. This is obviously like a pop up. It's not here in summer. Right here, if you can see inside. People are skating. I'm so glad that we came out today. So much live music here in this square. I just want to show you guys the lights. When I see vlogs, when people come to Munich during summer, it looks so different during winter. It's like a different side of Munich that a lot of people don't get to show. But yeah, like, look at the like, Christmas lights. And they have like candles decorated all over them. This is one of the stores that sells um, candles. And along the way, you will see quite a few of them with very unique decorations. It's not a pretty shop. Let's go down. We're not even at the main area yet. There's already so many things to see. I really like the Christmas tree on top. 
that it's very cute. It's one of the more famous church in Munich. And voila. Okay, you guys ready for it? Welcome to the town square of Marion Platz. How pretty is this scene? Christmas markets are very, very pretty, obviously. <laughs> but when there's a lot of people, it gets a little bit hectic. They sell all sorts of stuff here. So this is a complete view of the town hall from the ground up. It looks really grand against the Christmas tree and also the shops at the back. Mama. I am on the hunt for my glue wine in a shoe cup. I really need it before the Christmas market ends. Wait, I think I see it. I think I see the shop. I see it. They have the shoe cup. They have the shoe cup. They do. They have the shoe cup. Oh, you got it. Yeah. It's oh. a proper German shoey. <laughs> cheese cheese. Toe cheese. Ah, I got the punch. Very punchy. Mmm, that's kick. It's got the. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's adorable. Different designs. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry German Christmas. Beautiful glass windows all the way up. My favorite. It's like a spiral stairs that go upwards. Wow, it's just so magnificent. The main door that you come in from the plaza. We're back to the Christmas market. So I'm gonna go return one of the cups. I can't carry too much of them, so I'll return the red one. And we're gonna bring one home. <laughs> in the hotel, just wanna show you a few things before I go back into the room. Very quick checkout system. You literally do not need to go to the reception to do that. Let's go upstairs. Check-in area is on the fourth floor. There's all the different amenities here. This is the check-in area, also a bar. So it looks really cute, very cozy. I really love boutique hotels. <laughs> wow. They even have a nice terrace on the fifth floor. Heading back to the hotel room, I'm gonna pack. That's it for Munich and Germany. Wrapping it up. Yay! Oh, today is Christmas Eve! Finished spending one and a half hour packing. We are heading to Vienna today. So this room has been serving us well. We're packing up our four luggages and then moving the city again. <laughs> the next city that we're going, Vienna, and also a new country, so excited. We're gonna be staying there slightly longer, so um, it's gonna be so much easier for us to unpack and repack. I'm very excited today because I've always wanted to go to Vienna, especially on Christmas, and it's happening. I don't know how, but it's, it's happening. I'm just gonna do some one last few flips. Oh, this is the outside. It looks very quiet on the 24th day. There's no one outside. That's it. We're leaving. See ya. <laughs> This is going to be a three hour and a half journey. From there, we'll be stopping at St. Bolton. From there, we need to run across. Run across. We'll just chill for a nice four hour 